G'day guys, Cambo here. I'm out in front of 7-Eleven. What we're gonna do is a 7-Eleven challenge to see what I can get for 15 Australian dollars, which is in total around 370 baht on today's global rate. So I can't film inside, so I'm gonna go and get the goodies, go back to the room, we'll have a look, and we'll do a taste test on the toasties. And I'm back. Spent about 10 minutes in the 7-Eleven. Remember I said $15 Australian was the challenge to go under. Now that would be on today's rate of 24.73 AUD to Thai Baht would have been around 370. Well, I'll, I'll show you, like you would have seen what I've just got, but we'll go and itemize what I got and I've come in way under budget. I spent Actually, you know what? Let's leave that one till the end. I'll show you. Let's have a look what I've got. So, I've got quite a bit of drink. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, I've got two of these as a, as a kickoff. Um, two Yakults, really good for gut health. Um, those in the probiotics will, the idea is to keep, keep stop you from getting sick. Um, food poisoning, that stuff like that makes you um, really good for gut health. So, I always have one of these every day. I've got those. Three bottles of Chung, but not what you think. Chang water. So three of them, just to have some extra ones in the fridge, especially if I do have a big night out, comes in handy. Three of them. My go-to. I'm pretty sure, I'm sure that's Coke, no sugar, it is. Coke Zero, two cans of those. Different, they've got all different color cans. They've got a cherry version of that, so two of them. Sweps Manau, which is Sweps Lime. Beautiful, the sugar-free version. Goes great with gin. Um, really nice, refreshing drink um, in the heat. Without the sugar, pretty good, you know, pretty good, nice, refreshing. So two of them. Two of them, two of the Cokes, three of the Chung Waters. Then what else did we get? These are pretty funky. Milo Choco Bar, a little bit different to the Choco Bars back in Australia. Then on to some snacks I'm going to have during the week. These are a favourite of mine. Magic Sandwich Cracker Cheese. I'll tell you my little secret for these. With these ones. G'day old mate. Put a bit of Vegemite on it. Smix. So good. Okay. Leave the neck and give you some of that. What else did I get? Something a bit different. Peanuts mixed with anchovies. Thought I had to get something a little bit out of my comfort zone. Two things remaining. Had, had these in Phuket, these are amazing. Crispy chicken skin, sriracha flavor. Really, really nice. Um, around Kangaroo Bar, the chicken man comes around and um, you can buy the chicken skin. It is schmick, not very good for you, but very nice. And last but not least, Lay's Ma Max, so these are like it. Um, extra crunch. I've got grilled prawn with goyu jang sauce, so they're going to be a bit spicy. Okay, and then I almost forgot. Look at these babies. Toasties. So I've got this one. I've got cheese. I've got cheese and ham. So some of this stuff I'll open for you in the video. Some I won't. Can't go for. I've got some rubber bands to seal stuff back up, but. Don't want to be, you know, I haven't eaten today, like I'm, I fasted for a reason, but don't want to be making a pig of myself, you got, you know, already big bloke. Okay, so the one thing with the toasties, these were 30, like 27 baht and 37 baht, so you're looking at, you know, just over a dollar. The one thing they do is they're not very good on the, um, the toast. This one's a little bit better. So I've got cheese, I've got cheese and ham, so let's split it. This is the, this is the cheese and ham, give you a look on the inside, you've got your ham, you've got your cheese. Have a quick bite. Bloody good. Very, very good. Just gonna have a water so I can wash some of this stuff down for you. Now we go on to this one is just plain cheese, again, a lot more 
cook better. Oh, it's all that cheese. Fuck yeah. Heart attack waiting to happen. And bam, really good. So what I'm gonna do when I finish that, put a bit of veggie mod on it. Schmick. Um, they're really good. You know, we did before a day trip. Got some, I haven't got a microwave here, but where I stayed last time. We um, got a couple of microwave them and then took them out before we um, went on a day trip. Um, a lot of, a lot of um, tourists that rave about them, really easy to do. They are nice and they're cheap. Okay, so I'm just going to try a couple of snacks for the rest, just to finish the video off. Um, let's hit up. I won't eat any of these, I'm just going to show you them. Um, just to give you a little bit of texture, I've had them before I know what they taste like. There's, a good, there's an original flavour, they're a little bit too sweet. Whereas these have got um, a real nice savoury, not too hot, even though they're sriracha. But yeah, very, very nice. Excuse me. How does this look like that? I'll just give you a bit of a... They are very crispy. Let's take a little bite. So good. Fill them back up for later. Have a drink. Could be in the 7 Eleven for ages. There's so much different stuff there. And depending on how adventurous you are, there's all different kinds of snacks. There's, there's rice snacks. There's dried fish. All sorts of stuff. And it's so cheap. Like 7 baht for a bottle of water. You know, you're looking... Probably about 20, 30 cents max. Wash that down. Gonna leave the peanuts with mixed anchovies then because I am a bit, even though I like anchovies, a bit scared. Let's go to grilled prawn with Gigi Jane sauce. So very Korean. Let's go to pack it. Okay. These are these um, new ones they've brought out that are extra crunchy. So they look like a... Uh, give you a bit of a look. Okay, let's go to crunch. Bring this up for the crunch. Yeah, subtle prawny flavour. A small bit of spice. I actually thought it'd be a bit spicier than that, to be honest. But yeah, very good. Okay. We'll go on to these. Before we almost wrap it up. Small, not real. I thought they'd smell a bit more fishier than that. And um, they're spicy as well, so that's always a good thing. Just want to get a handful that has a bit of anchovy as well. Oh fuck, there's a massive anchovy. Just so you know I'm not being a pussy. So we've got, put that there, you can see the anchovy, a little bit chilli. And here, let's do, we'll do this all in the one bite so we get it all. A little bit of fishiness, not so salty, I'm surprised. A little bit sweet, and a little bit of heat. Um, interesting, I'm not sure if I like them or not, being brutally honest. Um, I like anchovies as a rule, but that was a bit average. Okay, last one, and I'm gonna do it my way. Glad I got some rubber bands and some bags. 
Otherwise all this stuff be open. Oh wow, they make these hard. Few moments later. So, I finally got these buggers open. They're pretty cool. So they're just like a, a Jats cracker with, instead of having, it's like a, it's like a Jats cracker Oreo. Instead of having chocolate and vanilla, you've got Jats, you've got cheese. Now the one thing that I do that makes these even next level is this. You know, I don't have a butter knife, I've only got a spoon. A smidgen of the real black gold. Bet you might never leave Australia without it. Chuck it on, don't be shy. How it's all like that. And give you go, let's do it. Yeah, you get scanning out of everything here. That would be my favourite thing. The sandwich cracker with cheese and Vegemite. Magic, absolute magic. Okay, so I'll just wash this down to finish. So you can see there, let's do a quick count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14 items there. All purchased today, 7-Eleven down the road here on Low Crow Road. How much do you think? $15? No. So we didn't met the 370, no one near it. We came in at 264 baht, including two baht for the bag, and which comes to around $10.37 on today's rate, Australian. Not too sure what it is. Obviously, it'd be even less US and even less again for pound sterling, but working just off Australian because hey, I'm an Australian. Absolute value for money. Now, this is stuff that obviously the sandwiches I'm going to have now, but these will be my snacks for the next four days. Maybe even take them on the bus. I've got things to seal them up. My drinks because there's no mini bar here, which I don't mind. And as you can see, really, really cheap. Um, you know, a good way to save rather than going out, buying drinks, doing that kind of stuff. You know, I'm going to have an afternoon editing this afternoon, so it's going to be really a good way to do it. So guys, that's my 7-Eleven challenge in June 2022. Thank you very much for watching. Remember, hit the, hit the like. It helps the channel. Smash the subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the alert so you know, and there will be a lot of videos coming. And remember, tell your mates, Cambo's on tour in Asia. Thanks for watching.